The change in global and regional climate patterns, that is climate change, has affected availability of food in the country over the years. This has posed great threats in terms of food security, which has become a growing concern over the inconsistent change in climate. People themselves and the natural there have been renewed measures by stakeholders to help farmers mitigate the overwhelming challenges of climate change. John Retcher, a research scientist at Climate Change Agriculture and Food Security Program, explains the solution to this major crisis. Planting of seeds that are more appropriate, where the varieties of crops that have been chosen are those crops which can mature within a short window. Another aspect of it is crops that are capable of withstanding the uh, diseases and even tolerating pests that are there. Why? Because climate change has led to uh, emerging pests and diseases which are thriving and flourishing in environments where they have not been there before. For example, the fall armyworm. Climate smart agriculture is an approach to agriculture that helps transform agricultural systems to ensure food security in changing climate. Besides the Ndengu revolution in Kitui County, farmers in Akuru County are being encouraged to grow potatoes. Potato, being a, a short season crop, requiring uh, short rains to mature. We think it's a good crop which can be used to mitigate the effects of climate change the county. The Netherlands Development Organization, in collaboration with Bagengen University and Research, is supporting such initiatives aimed at empowering farmers to adapt to climate change through a project known as Climate Smart Agriculture East Africa. It is a five-year project valued at 39 million euros and is implemented in Kenya, Tanzania and Uganda. We shall work with the national and county government to see how could we create an enabling legal, institutional and uh, regulatory framework. In terms of potato farming, we're talking about uh, machinery that will soften that soil enough, uh, dig it deeper, and, and we've been touching it before. We're talking about mechanization that will plant potato on the ridge and not at the bottom of the ridge. We're talking about a mechanization that will give that potato such a, a beautiful environment for it to prosper. We have a real problem at the marketing level within the value chain of potatoes because we have got so many players who are engaged in buying, in brokerage of this very important group. Amidst these challenges, the county government is positive that through the support of SNV, the potato growing initiative will be a success. The program will work on the four value chains, uh, that is the pulses, the oil seed, iris potato, and the cereals. So each country will choose the specific crop that they want to pursue around those uh, four value chains, and each county will choose the specific crop that they want to pursue around those four value chains. In a nutshell, experts say there is need for continued sensitization of farmers about smart farming methods that can be used to ensure the country is food secure. Wanjiro Thiongo of Charms Media for KTN News.